sulfur and sulfur oxides. Sulfur is a non-metallic element that is found in the second period and the group number 16 in the periodic table. From the group number, which is 16, you could see that it has six valence electrons, two of which in the 3s orbital and four in the 3p orbital. Sulfur is a very reactive element that accepts two electrons in the 3p orbital to reach the electronic configuration of the nearest noble gas, which is argon. Sulfur exists as octasulfur, S8 molecule, not as a diatomic molecule like nitrogen N2. The reason behind that, sulfur has a large atomic size, which allows for each sulfur atom to singly bond to another sulfur atom. As each sulfur atom needs two electrons to fill the p orbital, each sulfur atom singly bonds to two sulfur atoms, and the result is the Packard ring, which contains eight sulfur atoms singly bonded to each other. Sulfur impurities found in fossil fuel cause many environmental problems. The burn of fossil fuel releases sulfur dioxide gas, SO2, that reacts with nitrogen dioxide, NO2, to form sulfur trioxide, SO3. The problem with sulfur trioxide, SO3, is that it reacts with water vapor in the air, forming sulfuric acid, which is a very corrosive acid. Sulfur oxides are also released from volcanic activities in large quantities, which when coming in contact with atmospheric vapor, they form sulfuric acid as well. Sulfuric acid is a diaporatic acid. It can give two protons, not one like HCl or HNO3, which makes the pH of sulfuric acid lower than the pH of comparable, comparable concentration of HCl. For 0.1 molar H2SO4, the pH goes to, for the first proton, is equal to 0.7, and for the second proton is 0.2, where HCl 0. molar has a pH equal 1. The oxidation number of sulfur and sulfuric acid H2SO4 is equal to plus 6. Like we said earlier, sulfuric acid is a very corrosive acid that is considered the main cause of acid rain. Acid rain has a very harmful effect on environment. For plants, where acid rain falls on soil, the pH of the soil is lowered and dissolves many nutrients, which leaches the nutrients from the soil. Acid rain also dissolves the waxy materials on the leaves, which make them lose water and attacked easily by insects. Water sources are also affected by the acid rain. Acid rain lowers the water's pH, which affects the lives of many larva insects as a result. Food for higher food chain is reduced, endangering many animals' lives. Acid rain containing H2SO4 affects the buildings as well. Carbonate rocks used in buildings dissolve due to the acid rain and iron rust is because of the acid rain. So the very harmful effect of sulfuric acid in, on environment, it is very important acid that is used in many industries. It is used in the manufacture of fertilizers, detergents, paints, pigments, dyes, synthetic fibers. It is also used in car batteries, tanning leather, and cleaning metal services, which is called pickling. For the preparation of sulfuric acid in industry, we use contact process. The reaction starts by heating molten sulfur S with air containing oxygen gas O2, where sulfur dioxide SO2 is formed. In the contact tower, the formed sulfur dioxide SO2 is further oxidized into sulfur trioxide SO3 in the presence of vanadium as a catalyst. As you could see, this reaction is at equilibrium. This is why to shift the reaction towards the formation of sulfur trioxide SO3, high temperature is used. Sulfur trioxide SO3 is dissolved in concentrated sulfuric acid forming helium, which is sulfuric acid fumes H2, S2, O7. Helium 
H2S2O7 in valuation tower is reacted safely with water to produce sulfuric acid. You have to remember, sulfuric acid reaction with water is an exothermic reaction that releases a huge amount of energy. That is why helium is used to react with water. That's that we came to the end of the video. Thank you and goodbye.